Coldplay's back with a new single, thank God. Even if it is for a movie, this is one of those songs that just blows you away. Not what you're expecting, you expect it to possibly be cliche since it's for a movie, but I should have known better. The Hunger Games did a great job the first time around picking out their songs from District 12, the soundtrack to the first movie. Catching Fire is in theaters November 22nd. Huge fan of the first film, definitely seeing the second one. And with Atlas by Coldplay being the lead single from this album, I'm super excited to see what else they have lined up for this. Atlas first listen took me back to like parachutes and a rush of blood to the head type days from Coldplay, a much simpler time in music. They really, really went back to their roots for this track, and I think that is phenomenal. I'm really excited to see. Oh, Greg's here. Boy George is a great icon, just to give you a heads up. Anyways, thanks to my friend Craig for that great piece of musical advice, but like I was saying with the new single Atlas from Coldplay, it's very melodic, there's a lot of pianos on the track, a lot of guitars kick in towards the end of the song, they really give that sweet feel that rounds out, almost painting a picture of like, I don't know, a clear day looking ahead, and I like the comparison to like, carry the world, basically talking about carrying a map, which is what Atlas is when literally translated like a book of maps and that sort of thing. So I think it's a really cool track. I suggest you guys check it out. It's a 4.5 out of 5 from me. What did you guys think? Let me know in the comments section down below. And of course, leave suggestions for future episodes of Throwback Thursday, SOS, and of course, a track review that you would like to see. Thanks for watching and subscribing right here on Beyond ARTV, Beyond the Reviews. <laughs> That's a wrap. We got C Reg on the set. It's a cut. You're welcome. I set up this. Did you? You came in about halfway.